Hello everyone and welcome to I Love Smoochie. Today we're having baked creamy pork chops and rice. Now here are the ingredients that we're going to have today. We're going to use a medium onion, celery stalk, salt, onion powder, Morton season oil, black pepper, garlic powder, and cream of chicken by four cans, and long grain rice and pork chops. Alright, now let's get started. We're going to rinse two and a half cups of long grain rice five to six times until the water becomes clear. By rinsing the rice several times, you are removing debris and surface starch that causes the rice to clump together or get gummy when it cooks. Look at how clear the water is getting. About the fifth or sixth time, this is how it should work. We're going to take one medium onion and slice it. And then we're going to take four celery stalks and we're going to cut it. And we're going to mix the celery and onion in the bowl together. Okay, we're going to layer the pork chops in the pan. We're going to use seasonal. garlic powder black pepper and salt We're going to massage the seasoning into the meat to make sure it is well coated evenly. I am going to flip the meat over and season it again. All right, we're gonna use one and a half cups of rice. We're gonna lay a half of the onions and celery meat.
And we're going to repeat these steps. Now we're going to use one cup of rice. Add the rest of the onion and celery. We're going to use four cans of cream of chicken soup. Then we're going to add a half a cup of water to one of the cans to remove the rest of the soup. Then transfer from one can to another and pour it into the pan. Now we're going to add 4 cups of water. Gently move the soup in between the meat and spread it evenly on the top. Place in the oven on 425 degrees for 1 hour and 20 minutes. Now let's see if it's all done. Mm, mm. Oh yes, it's done.
Now let's take a closer look. Okay, we're just going to plate this pork chop and then we're going to add some of the delicious creamy gravy and then we're going to add some of the celery. All right, now this is how it looks. Now you know I'm not gonna end this video without cutting into this thing and showing you how juicy and tender it is. Don't this look delicious? Alright everyone, if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. And if you would like to try the recipe, go ahead and try it. And then come back and leave me a comment and tell me how you liked it. Okay? Thanks for watching. Love you all. Smooching.